We tied a record high today of 73 degrees and this high temperature was set back or we tied the record high temperature set back in 1965 of 73 degrees, 47 the low this morning. Check out downtown Marquette at the U.S. Coast Guard. We had a high temperature today of 74 and a low of 57. High temperatures across the rest of the UP today were in the 70s, 67 though for Manistique and 66 for Escanaba, just a tad bit cooler. Temperatures right now, 6 o'clock Eastern, 5 o'clock Central hour are still on the warm side for the middle to end of October. We got 71 still for Munising, down from a high temperature today of 75, 74 Houghton and also Ironwood, but we do have cooler air back on off towards the west and that cooler air is headed this way. So here's three things to know here. We are looking at cool to chilly temperatures for tonight along with the cool and chilly temperatures that will be moving in tonight. They're going to continue as we go into Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and into the weekend. During this time, we will also have some gusty winds and some rain shower chances and by Friday some of that rain could mix in with some wintry precipitation. Here's weather in motion here across the UP. Clouds picking up the pace tonight. Could see some light precipitation in the higher terrain west of Marquette and also in the Barriga County. Then as we go into Wednesday, definitely more clouds than sun. Watch your rain move in from Wisconsin here. That rain's going to be moving into the south central UP tomorrow afternoon and then we do have a chance of rain for a good chunk of the UP through tomorrow night into early Thursday morning. The only exception would be the Keweenaw Peninsula as we go into tomorrow on into tomorrow night. And then as we go into Thursday, this storm system starts to pull on off towards the east. Behind it, we start to see just a little bit of some lake effect rain. Otherwise, outside of the lake effect rain, we should get in some sunshine. So overall, we're in the warm sector of this storm system that's on off towards the west. That's why we are seeing the warmer temperatures. This area of low pressure will move to the south Wednesday on into Wednesday night in the first part of Thursday behind it. Here comes the chilly air that we're going to start to see tonight and for the rest of the week. As we get into Friday, though, we do have a piece of energy that will be dropping in from the north. That's going to once again bring back some rain shower chances. And then Friday night, we could see some wintry precipitation. Not going to add up to much, though, if any, but just a reminder of what season is on the way. So as we look at your forecast for tonight, we are looking at temperatures that will be cooling off, becoming chilly as we go through the night. More clouds move in. Light precipitation can't be ruled out in higher terrain west of Marquette. Look for low temperatures tonight to drop back into the 40s to perhaps right around 50 degrees as you go in and along the Great Lakes here, Munising, Grand Marais, Manistique, and over towards St. Ignace. We'll see low temperatures right around 50 or perhaps the lower 50s. But as you can see, definitely out west, cooling on off. For your UP community extended forecast, Marquette, Marquette County, we are looking at temperatures in the 50s for tomorrow. That's it, and then 40s to perhaps around 50 if we can sneak in just a little bit of sun for Thursday. More clouds are back for Friday and Saturday, and some wintry precipitation can't be ruled out, especially at night and the early in morning. For the eastern UP, UP. We'll see temperatures tomorrow only in the 50s. It'll be cooler with some rain showers, some gusty winds, some lake effect rain showers can't be ruled out for Thursday and then cloudy, some rain showers and perhaps some wintry precipitation inland night and early morning Friday and Saturday for Delta County and Escanaba. We'll see temperatures on the cooler side for tomorrow highs in the 50s. Rain starts to move in as well as we go into the afternoon and into the night. Some morning rain on Thursday and then some afternoon sunshine for Thursday and then rain showers possible for Friday. Some wintry precipitation precipitation inland Friday night into Saturday morning is possible. Cooler with some wind for Wednesday along with some rain and then around 50 for Thursday for the interior west. 40s for Friday and Saturday. Some wintry precipitation can't be ruled out Friday night on into Saturday and possibly Friday morning as well. And then for the Keweenaw Peninsula, a slight chance of rain here. Probably not going to see much rain here in the Keweenaw for this round of rain. And then some lake effect rain showers are possible for Thursday. Friday, rain showers, same for Saturday and some wintry precipitation can't be ruled out. Becca, back to you. Thank you, Tom.